We rented a car from Dollar Rent a Car at the Burbank Airport. Um, we rented a midsize and paid for a midsize car up front. Um, when we got there, we were given a car that was, uh, I love to call a shoebox. <laughs> um, and so I, 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 I'm very adamant about the fact that this car did not belong in the freeways in Los Angeles. Um, it, this car would have been fine for a, for a household that wanted to take pick groceries or take the kids to school, but not safe to drive on the freeways in Los Angeles. Um, and especially not safe for what we used it for, which was going up in the mountains for a wedding. Um, it was dangerous and um, driving next to the big trucks on the freeway was, a, uh, was taking a life in our own hands. And I would recommend that, that Dollar rent a car in the future, add one or two questions to, to their rental process to make sure that the car that they're receiving is adequate and meets their needs. And, and I wanna emphasize that I'm aware of the shortage of cars. I mean, um, but we should at least be given an option of, of getting a car that fit what we're looking for. And we received a car that literally three of us in our suitcases did not, not fit. First of all, when we, when we, uh, we my wife um, arranged for a rental and paid for it up, up front, and we arrived at the airport in Burbank, I'm well aware of, of the shortage of rental cars. Um, however, um, we got down to the rental car place. Um, the gentleman who was there was, was, was terrific, frankly. Um, he helped us, but, but there literally had, had people, we were there, we were like second or third in the line, which wasn't bad. By the time we finished our transaction, it was probably 30 people behind us. And what they were doing literally was driving uh, return cars up, not cleaning them, and then just saying, here's a car, here's a car, go. Um, and like the, the gentleman in front of us, a um, single, single man by himself, um, got an SUV. Um, I was traveling with myself, my wife, um, and my mother-in-law. And um, we had huge suitcases. We were down there for a wedding, and we were given a car that was, wasn't even a subcompact, it was tiny. It was a tiny little car. Um, so we, we literally could not fit one or two suitcases in the back. So I had to have one in the lap, on my lap in the back seat. Um, that, was, that was the initial problem. Um, the, the, the problem to compound the situation was we're in Los Angeles, we had this little itsy bitsy car, which I, which I, I told in my, my review, I said, this car doesn't belong in the streets in Los Angeles. I mean, driving this little tiny car next to trucks on the freeway was literally death defying. It was, it was a scary experience. Um, my wife was driving the whole time and uh, going next to trucks, we were getting blown side, side to side. It was, it, was, it was not a safe experience. Um, I rented cars many times in the past and I've never said, where are you going or what we're using this for? But in this situation, to put me on the freeway, I mean, we, I mean, literally we had to drive, we had to go up to a wedding in the mountains, driving this little car in the mountains um, that barely made it, frankly, barely made it up, but all, one of the on-ramps of the freeway barely made it up. Um, and um, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was a joke. It was, it was, it was, a, it was a dangerous joke. Um, I was not looking for a solution. I wasn't asking for any kind of remuneration. I was asking, I was just filing a, a concern. Um, I spent many years of my career as a consumer reporter, and I think it's important to, to let, let, let the uh, public know about the situation. I mean, like I said, I'm aware of, of the shortage of rental cars, but there's, there should be some sensitivity as, as to what the car is being used for, um, are there any special needs, I mean, um, how far are you going? I mean, this car was was fine for um, someone going to pick up groceries. <laughs> it, it was it was great for someone who was picking the kids up from school, but it was not safe to drive on the freeway. I was not asking for remuneration. I was I wanted to make sure this was this was uh, clearly communicated. Again, I, I wasn't going public. I was I was contacting Dollar directly. I was I was asking them to 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 review their their their. Um, their fleet and, and uh, rent appropriate cars. 
I was, I was, I was, I mean, like I said, I spent many years of my career as a consumer reporter. And if I wanted to go public, I certainly could, but that was not my, my, my purpose was to contact them directly to, to issue my, to, to file my, my concerns. Thank you.